Prosecutors have filed a request for a warrant to detain the chief of retail giant Lotte Group on charges of embezzlement. Our Yi Min Young has the latest on this snowballing high profile corruption case. The Seoul Central District Prosecutor's Office has requested an arrest warrant for Lotte Group Chairman Shin Dong Bin for embezzlement and breach of trust charges. If the request is granted, it will be the first time in Lotte Group's decades long history that the chairman has been detained in a criminal investigation. Many observers had expected prosecutors to continue the investigation into Shin without detaining him, but officials reportedly made the decision based on the gravity of the charges against him and in consideration of possible future probes into other Korean conglomerates. The 61 year old has allegedly presided over questionable mergers and acquisitions, selling the assets at below market prices. He is also accused of amassing over $26 million in slush funds, siphoned off of the group's construction arm over the past decade. Prosecutors estimated that the total amount of illegal transactions could amount to as much as 154 million U.S. dollars. Shin was summoned for questioning last Tuesday and spent 18 hours under the microscope. Prosecutors say they also plan on charging Lotte's founder Shin Gyok Ho and the chair's older brother Shin Dong Ju without holding them in custody. The Seoul Central District Court will hold a hearing on whether to issue the arrest warrant, and the decision is expected Wednesday. Lee Min Young, Arirang News.